Imagine discovering that something you do every single day is quietly cutting years off your life, without pain, without warnings, and without you noticing. In the U.S., men live nearly six years less than women, and it's not because of accidents or extreme behavior. It's because of a handful of ordinary habits that slowly reshape your hormones, metabolism, heart, and brain over decades. Most men blame alcohol first, but here's the surprise. Alcohol is only number five on the list. The most dangerous habit is so common, so familiar, that almost every man watching this video is doing it right now. Over time, these habits don't cause sudden damage. They create quiet internal wear that builds year after year. Medically, this shows up as chronic inflammation, hormonal imbalance, insulin resistance, and accelerated biological aging. It's like running a powerful engine with dirty oil. Everything still works, but damage accumulates underneath. You may notice subtle signs first. Lower energy, poor sleep, weight gain, slower recovery, or constant tension. In this video, we'll break down how the damage starts, what changes first when you stop, and why the earliest days of change matter more than most men realize. When these habits first take root, usually in a man's 20s and early 30s, the body is incredibly forgiving. You can drink on weekends, sleep five or six hours, sit all day at work, feel stressed, and still wake up mostly functional. That's not because nothing is happening. It's because your body is covering the bill in the background. Early studies in preventive medicine show that markers of inflammation, insulin resistance, and vascular stiffness often begin rising in young adulthood long before symptoms appear. It's like putting small charges on a credit card. Nothing hurts yet, but the balance is quietly growing. As these habits persist into the late 30s and early 40s, the body's ability to compensate starts slowing down. Alcohol is a good example. Research from the CDC and long-term cohort studies show that liver repair capacity declines with age, even if drinking habits stay the same. That means the same amount of alcohol you tolerated easily at 25 causes more inflammation, more fat buildup in the liver, and more hormonal disruption at 40. Testosterone begins to drop, blood pressure creeps upward, and sleep quality declines. Many men describe this phase as feeling tired but wired, exhausted during the day but restless at night. The engine is still running, but it's overheating more often. Chronic stress becomes far more damaging during this stage as well. Large longitudinal studies, including decades-long research from Harvard, have shown that men living with persistent stress lose multiple years of life on average. Cortisol, the main stress hormone, is designed for short bursts. When it stays elevated, it raises blood sugar, increases abdominal fat, weakens immune function, and accelerates cardiovascular aging. Men rarely call this stress. They call it responsibility. But biologically, the body doesn't care what you call it. By the mid-40s to early 50s, social isolation begins quietly climbing the list of dangers. A massive meta-analysis involving more than 300,000 people found that weak social connections increased the risk of early death by up to 50%, comparable to smoking. Men often don't notice this happening. Friends drift away. Work and family fill the calendar. Conversations get shorter and more practical. But the body interprets isolation as a threat. Inflammatory markers rise. Stress hormones increase. Depression and anxiety become more likely. Men don't usually say they feel lonely. They say they're busy. The biology, however, reads it the same way. Around this same time, lack of sleep starts doing real damage. According to the American Academy of Sleep Medicine, men who consistently sleep fewer than six hours a night live over seven years less on average. Sleep is when the body repairs blood vessels, balances hormones, clears metabolic waste from the brain, and resets the immune system. Miss it repeatedly, and everything runs a little worse. Blood pressure rises blood sugar becomes unstable. Reaction time slows. Food drops. Many men assume this is aging. In reality, it's accumulated sleep debt. 
As men move into their 50s and beyond, the most dangerous habit often takes the lead, sitting too much. Long-term observational studies following tens of thousands of adults show that sitting more than eight hours a day significantly increases the risk of early death, even in people who exercise regularly. Prolonged sitting shuts down large muscle groups, especially in the legs, reducing glucose uptake and slowing circulation. After about 30 minutes of uninterrupted sitting, metabolism shifts into energy-saving mode. Fat storage becomes easier. Insulin resistance increases. Blood pools in the lower body. It's like leaving a powerful machine idling for years. Nothing explodes, but parts start corroding. What makes these five habits so destructive is not how extreme they are, but how normal they feel. Alcohol is socially accepted. Stress is praised. Poor sleep is worn like a badge of honor. Sitting is built into modern life. Isolation hides behind busyness. Research in aging consistently shows that small behaviors, repeated daily over decades, explain a large portion of the lifespan gap between men and women. Health doesn't collapse suddenly. It erodes quietly. The encouraging part is that biology responds quickly when the signal changes. Studies on lifestyle interventions show that reducing alcohol intake improves blood pressure and sleep within weeks. Lowering stress brings measurable drops in cortisol and inflammation. Rebuilding social connection improves immune markers and mood faster than most people expect. Sleeping seven to eight hours restores insulin sensitivity and cognitive performance within days. Standing up and moving every 30 minutes improves circulation and metabolic function almost immediately. The body is not waiting for perfection. It responds to direction. Men who make small, consistent changes often notice benefits long before lab results change. Energy improves. Sleep deepens. Focus returns. Weight becomes easier to manage. These aren't motivational slogans. They are predictable biological responses observed again and again in research. The body wants to heal. It just needs fewer obstacles. When these habits persist, men's health declines slowly and quietly. But when even one of them changes, the trajectory shifts. Longevity isn't built through extreme discipline or dramatic overhauls. It's built through small decisions, repeated daily, that give your biology a chance to do what it's designed to do, adapt, repair, and protect your life. These habits don't ruin men's health all at once. They slowly steer life in the wrong direction over time. What makes them dangerous is how normal they feel when nothing hurts yet. The good news is your body responds quickly when you change even one habit. Standing up more, sleeping a bit longer, easing stress, and reconnecting with people all help right away. And when we say drinking less, we mean less alcohol, not less water, because cutting back gives your liver and sleep a real break. You don't need extreme changes to see results. Small, consistent choices lower inflammation and bring energy back faster than most men expect. If one habit in this video felt familiar, take that as a signal to start. And if this helped, share it and subscribe for more science-based ways to live longer and feel better.